This is a detailed full review of the Life Fuel Smart Water Bottle. So the video is a bit long, but don't worry. I'm adding timestamps with descriptions so you can go right to the part of the video you're looking for. I don't know if you can see that, but it, it did dispense. It's a bag. It's a plane. No, it's Dash Inspector. Hey y'all. So today we're checking out what appears to be a really cool gadget. Okay, it's a really expensive smart bottle. It goes for about $99. It's the uh, Life Fuels Smart Nutrition Bottle, okay? Now Life Fuels was nice enough to send this off to me for review. So we're gonna check it out, man. I'm into gadgets. You're into gadgets. Let's check it out. I haven't done an unboxing video on my channel in quite a while, but I think uh, I think I want to go ahead and do that so you can see the entire presentation and actually get my real time impressions. I think this thing is going to be really cool, man. It better be for ninety nine dollars. So let's go to the office and get some close ups of this thing and check it out. OK, let's go ahead and get in this box already. Uh, one of the main things that makes this bottle unique is that you can flavor the water using these fuel pods that you insert in the bottom of the bottle. And there's an app that you can download uh, that allows you to administer the, uh, the various flavors and to track your water intake. And as you can see on the box, it has uh, advertised battery life of up to four days, uh, 30 beverages per fuel pod, and then you see the hydration tracking. The bottle is BPA free. All right, I'll give you some more specs um, either in this segment or maybe I'll do another voiceover, but I'll give you all the information you need. And then here's some nutritional information about those fuel pods. Now, Life Fuel sent me a gang of those things. Um, they aren't cheap either. I'll put up on the screen um, pricing information for the fuel pods. But let's go ahead and open this thing up. I'm excited to get, get this thing all unboxed and to start using it. So check out the box. It's a really cool looking box. Presentation is really, really cool. I have to admit that. There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and get the top off. And booyah, there it is. <laughs> There's the bottle. Let me take this thing out. All right, check it out. Wow. It's not super heavy. But there you go. That's where the fuel pods go. And looks like some kind of activation button there on the front. And let's see. Is this where you charge it up? Yep, that's a micro USB charging port there. And you've got a uh, carrying strap here. Cool. And that definitely is plastic. And looks like the top opens up here. There we go. Okay, before I start uh, fooling with this, I wanna put it to the side for now. Let's see what else is in the box. Okay. Turn over for quick start. Okay, let's pull that out. Ah, there are the fuel pods. So you do get, you do get some fuel pods um, in the box as well. 
Okay, lifefuels.com get started. Clean your bottle, charge your bottle, download the app. Okay, so I better do that. Let's see what else. Oh, there's the quick start guide right there. So pretty much everything you should need to know to get the bottle set up and ready to go. Uh, so I'm gonna follow the directions here. I'm gonna give the bottle a clean. I'm gonna charge it up. I'm gonna download the app and then I'll come back and we'll get started. Now it does say bottle base is not dishwasher safe. So I imagine this top part must come off. Looks like that screws down there, but I'll figure all of that out so I don't break the darn thing. But let's see, do not place your bottle in the refrigerator. Wow, bottle is not microwave safe. Okay, keep components out of the reach of children. Okay, so all important things. Okay, it shows you how to clean the bottle right here. Fully dis disassemble your bottle, including the expansion bulb and vessel gasket. So you can see here how everything kind of separates. This thing looks like a, a rocket ship. You know what I mean? With the thrusters on the bottle, on the bottom. Kind of twist the top off, just like so. And it comes right off. It looks like there's some kind of gasket here to kind of seal it in. I'm gonna leave that there. And then this bottom part comes off as well. That's where you can put the uh, fuel pods in. And it looks like there's a reset button, uh, reset slash power button right here. You can see that. Okay, so I'm gonna clean it, charge it, download the app, and I'll be back. Actually, before I do that, let's look at what else is in the box. So let's take a look at the fuel pods. So. This one says multivitamins uh, daily. This is peach flavor. This one says electrolytes. And make sure you can see that electrolytes. And this is lemon lime flavor. And I believe you can mix and match all of these to kind of come up with your own flavors. Uh, that says antioxidants and that's blackberry acai. Cool, all right, so let's see what we've got underneath here. Okay, so clean. Okay, cool. So they even give you something to clean the bottle with, and based on what I'm seeing in the instructions here, or the quick start guide, this is what you use to clean the base, because you're never gonna wanna immerse this in water. So you just clean, use it to clean this here, just like so and also to clean the uh, pod bays here, just like so. See that? Okay, so there's the charger. Okay, so you get the charging brick there, and it's just a micro USB cable. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and do all of that uh, cleaning, charging, and I'll be back. I'm gonna get the app downloaded. Okay, so I've gone ahead and washed the bottle, took everything apart, I charged it, we're good to go. All right, I've downloaded the app and um, we're at the point now uh, where it's um, wanting me to power up the bottle so that we can pair it. So app is pretty good, it's showing you exactly where to go. So let's just unscrew that and you can see the power button right here. Push the power button. All right, and you can see it's lighting up. Very cool. Looks like a freaking rocket, man. So let's hit next. See if we can pair this thing. Find your serial number. That's my bottle. Okay, so you can see what it's doing as it's pairing. The lights are flashing, different colors. Okay, connection timed out. I guess we have to try that again. Okay, try it again. Press the front button to confirm. Oh, you have to press the front button here to confirm the pairing process. 
So I press that. I missed that the first time. Okay, all ready. All set, ready to drink, it says. Start fueling. Okay, allow life fuels to use your location. They use this location to keep tabs on your bottle's location. Okay, I will say allow while using the app. Turn on notifications. Yes, we want notifications on. Okay, now it's telling me what to do. Fill the vessel with water. Load a pod. Twist to secure. Select by pressing the bottle button or tapping on the pod bubble in the app. Okay, so here. Hold it down to dispense, sip and enjoy. Okay, so you can see the app here. Looks like it's tracking your water intake here. Looks like this is where you can create your own beverage. This is where you can buy those pods. And this is good because I wanna show you how much these things cost. So you can see, it looks like you get three of these for $26.64, and that's when you subscribe. Um, so you got these different pod packs, Defend Pod Pack, Workout Pod Pack, and you can see the pricing there. So these are kind of expensive. So you get three for 90, I'm sorry, three for 30 bucks for this one, three for 26 bucks, three for 26 bucks. Uh, looks like you can buy them individually here. So you can kind of see what they're costing. They're about 10 bucks per. So you get an idea of the cost of ownership of this thing. And there's your profile tab as well. Okay, so what we're gonna do now, we're gonna start loading these pods. Uh, but first, let me go put some water in it and then we'll come back and I'll start loading these pods in, see how that goes. Okay, so I've got the bottle filled with water, as you can see here, and this holds 16.9 fluid ounces. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna start loading these pods. So I'm just gonna crack these open. Okay, so just a quick look at the uh, nutritional facts on these things. This is the uh, multivitamin one, the peach and looks like it's using stevia as its sweetener. So there's no sugar or high fructose corn syrup or anything like that. Uh, five calories per serving, which is uh, two shots is one serving. One, uh, one gram um, of carbs, a uh, bunch of vitamins here. Mmm, smells good. That smells really good. It's peachy. Okay, so it says to stick it in and to screw it. And wow, you can see it show up right away in the app. Isn't that cool? <laughs> so it's showing up right away. Looks like that 30 uh, means you have 30 shots. So we need to do the same thing for the other pods. And this one is antioxidants, and this is blackberry acai. Just stick it in there and rotate, and right away it recognizes it. And see how the colors, the bottle actually lights up corresponding to the color of the pot. And then you, you even see the, the color corresponding to the pot show up here as well. Let's do the last one. Electrolytes, lemon lime. This one is actually five calories. All of these are flavored by stevia, so there's no sugar or anything like that in them. You can see how that light turns to green. See that? Isn't that cool? How does it know that? That light turned to green and that light turned to green. So the first one I put in was, was the peach, then the purple, then the green. Okay, so there's a couple ways you can go about this. Let's try with the button on the bottle. So I guess this is how you select. So you can select the purple one, the peach one, or the lemon lime. And I guess when you get to the one you want, you can just hold it down and that'll dispense. Same way with in the app, you can just push on the one you want and then you can see here, swipe to dispense. Wow, that is so cool. That, I gotta tell you, that's so cool. So you can do one shot, two shots, or three shots. 
It even gives you the nutritional information right here on the screen. I'm kind of geeking out here on this. Okay, let's try, let's try the peach. And let's swipe the dispense. Check it out. See what's happening? It's dispensing those two shots. Okay, and I believe I'm gonna need to shake that up. Like so. Okay, and I'm gonna give it a taste test here and see how it tastes. Maybe I need to add some more, a couple more shots. Well, let's check it out. Mmm. That is cool. It's almost like, you know those little uh, squirt bottles you can get from the grocery store? And you can, I think they call them like uh, water enhancers, or whatever, like the Mio's and those little ones. That's what it kind of tastes like, or almost like um, if you've ever had like vitamin water, it kind of tastes like that, really subtle. Um, but I am going to add another shot. I'll just add one shot this time. That is so freaking cool. Do you see this? <laughs> Shake it up. And let me try it now. Mm. That's good. That's good, y'all. I think I could get used to that. Okay, so it's the next day uh, after I opened the bottle up, got it all set up. Um, I didn't use it after that first use. Um, so I went to work, I didn't take it to work with me. I was actually a little nervous about taking this out uh, to work with me, but I'm gonna definitely take it with me tomorrow and I'll come back and give an update on that. But I wanna kinda look at the app uh, a little bit. We're gonna fill it with water and check out uh, the dispensing of the um, flavor pods once again. But let's take a quick look at the app, uh, which I think is really, really cool. So we can see here on yesterday, I dispensed three uh, servings, I guess. So you can see there, I have 27 of the peach left over and it did record my water intake. Uh, it's showing me that I saved the bottle so 16.9 ounces, that's you know one of those uh, bottled waters that you get in the 32 and 24 packs, right? Um, let's see, fuel log. So it's showing how much you drank and when. So this was on yesterday. So again, this was I haven't used it since then. And I'm not gonna lie, I get kind of bored drinking plain water. Um, I drink it because uh, I know I need it. I usually get my 64 ounces in. Um, right now I'm using a hydrate spark bottle, um, which works really, really well, but I can't add any flavor or anything to the water in that bottle. Let me show you here. This is the hydrate spark here, uh, uh hydrate steel actually, uh, really good bottle, but it doesn't do what this does. So let's go ahead and dispense. Let's try blackberry Akai this time. So I'm gonna hit that button, and as you can see, I can do one shot, two shots, or three shots. I'm gonna swipe to dispense and keep an eye on the bottle here. I don't know if you can see that, but it, it did dispense some of the flavor pods, and I'm gonna shake it up. Okay, and you can see in the app, now I have 28 left. I'm gonna go ahead and taste this and it will track every time I take a sip. Mm. It's good, but it's very subtle. So I'm definitely gonna add another, we'll call it another squirt. I'm gonna do two more shots and I'm gonna bring this up so you can see it go to work. I don't know if you can see that, but it's it's dispensing the flavor, flavoring there. Shake it up. And let's try it out now. Mm. 
It's very subtle, that one. Uh, the peach was more distinct. This one is, is a lot more subtle, but I like it. It's just enough to just take away that nothing or bland uh, taste of water or nothing taste of water. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. Water has no taste, <laughs> but it adds a little bit of flavoring, which is good. And I don't know if you noticed, if you see every time you take a sip, the bottle um, representation here in the app, it reflects how much is actually in the bottle. I think that's really cool. Keep an eye on that. Let me take a sip and keep an eye on what that does. Okay, so you see that? See how the water level drops corresponding to what's in the bottle? That's really cool, man. Really, really cool. And we can see my progress. Uh, I have 720 milliliters of the 2000 milliliter gold that I have set there. I'm gonna add one shot of the lemon lime. I hope this doesn't just taste disgusting, but let's try it. And again, I wanna make sure you guys can see this. I don't know if I don't know if that showed up well on camera, but it did dispense. Shake it up. Mmm. That's actually good. A nice little mix. Um, let's do it again. This time, <laughs> boy, it's really gonna be flavored up. But I really want to demonstrate this. So let's try using the button this time. Okay, make sure you can see this here. Okay, so when you push the button, it's gonna correspond to the color of the pot in the bottom. The one I want is the lemon lime, so that's the green. And then what you do is you hold the button down and then it dispenses. Just like that. Shake it up. Mm. Much, much stronger now, <laughs> but still good. And it's not overpowering. Even though I just put in, what did I do? I did three and three. So I essentially did six uh, six of those uh, servings well, it's not too bad it's really good but I just wanted to demonstrate that so on tomorrow I'm gonna take this to work see how it goes use it all day see how it tracks my water intake and then I'll give you some more thoughts uh, on tomorrow now I like to use products for a certain period of time before I actually do the review instead of uh, just doing an unboxing and then giving like uh, snap impressions and drawing conclusions from a single use. So I've been using the Life Fuels Smart Water Bottle for about three weeks. And I have to say, I really do like the bottle, but I'm gonna give you my honest uh, observations after using the bottle for that period of time. With that said, here are my pros and my cons. First, the cons. Now I discovered that the bottle won't fit into most car cup holders. Okay, here's one of the things that I wish were better about this bottle. So, as you can see, it kind of fits. I have kind of wide cup holders in my car. Um, so it kind of fits in there, but it doesn't fit all the way down. And I would imagine a lot of you um, may have the round kind, the round uh, cup holders in your car. So it's likely that this bottle will not fit in the cup holder in your car. All right, so keep that in mind. Um, kind of disappointing. One of the pod bays stopped working. And I noticed this a couple days ago, no matter what fuel pod I put in that particular bay, it would not dispense. The other two bays still work, but still a bummer that that one bay stopped working. I wish the carrying strap on the bottle was a bit stronger. It just feels, I never carry the bottle using that strap because it just, 
uh, it doesn't feel very secure. So I always just carry the bottle in my hand and that's what I would recommend you do. Okay, the last con is the price. The bottle is pretty expensive and when you look at the true cost of ownership with $10 per fuel pod, over the life of owning this bottle, you'll start to rack up some cost. Now, if you're really into gadgets like I am and really into like tracking data and stuff like this, it's a really cool gadget to have while trying to motivate yourself uh, to be more healthy and live a more healthy lifestyle. And I would imagine if you regularly purchase drinks like Gatorade or vitamin water, even those little uh, squirt bottles, if you're regularly purchasing those, you could look at this as kind of a replacement cost, but you have to decide that for yourself. Okay, now for the pros. So the first pro is this thing has encouraged me and motivated me to drink more water. Now, do you need a smart bottle to encourage yourself and motivate yourself to drink more water? No, but what this does for me is it's almost like a game where I wanna make sure I hit my goal every day and then I like to see data trending over time. I'm just kind of geeky that way. I'm into numbers, into graphics. Uh, so the app is really well fleshed out. That's another pro. Uh, it's very intuitive to use. There's good data in there uh, so that you can see when during the day you're drinking water, when you're not. Uh, those type of things are really, really cool. So you can start to see how much water you're drinking on a daily basis, weekly, monthly, so on and so forth. The other thing I consider to be a real pro is the ability to mix flavors. So you can uh, put the fuel pods in, in different configurations. You can try different sort of mixes out, which I did. And the ones that you really like, you can save them by creating a beverage. So it's a really, really nice feature, I think, because you don't have to remember, wait a minute, what, what flavors did I mix together? You can just save that as a beverage, and then when you want to uh, use that mix, you just select it and it'll do the rest. The four days of battery life I found to be accurate. Um, I think the battery life is good. And what I do when uh, the battery is getting low, I'll just charge the bottle overnight when I'm sleeping. And that usually does the trick for me. And the battery indicator is in the app. So at any time you can go in there and see how much battery life you have uh, left. So it'll let you know when you need to get that thing charged. Now I mentioned that one of the fuel pot bays on my particular bottle stopped working. But keep in mind, uh, the bottle does come with a one year warranty. I would suggest that you go out to their website and read through what their rep return policy sort of dictates, but there is a one year warranty. I consider that to be a pro. And lastly, Life Fuel seems to have some commitment to sustainability because they do provide a uh, bag uh, with a return postage, re return label on it, so you can return the used fuel pods back to them so you don't just toss those and those things have some technology in them there's some type of encryption uh, built in where that bottle can detect how much is left in the pod what flavor is in the pod all of that cool stuff so i would imagine they want those back to actually reuse them i would imagine that's what's happening i don't know that for sure but i would imagine they would get reused well all right that was my full detailed review of the Life Fuel Smart Water Bottle. I hope you found this useful. On this channel, I'm into all kinds of drones and all kinds of gadgets just like this. And if you're into that kind of stuff, you are in the right place, my friend. Please consider subscribing to the channel and don't forget to click that bell. That way you'll know when I upload new videos. All right then, as we always say, be good to somebody, be good to yourself. I'll check you out in the next video. Later.